28 Dinosaurs of Discovery by Johnny's Book Tyrannosaurus Rex The Tyrannosaurus Rex was the king of dinosaurs. It could grow over 12 meters long with teeth as big as bananas. Its strong legs made it fast and its roar could shake the ground. T-Rex ruled with power and fear. Triceratops Triceratops was a brave plant eater with three sharp horns and a wide neck frill. It lived in groups and defended itself against meat eaters. Calm and strong, it grazed peacefully among ferns and flowers. Stegosaurus Stegosaurus carried tall plates along its back and spikes on its tail. The plates helped it control body temperature, and the tail was its weapon. Slow but steady, it wandered through warm Jurassic valleys. Brachiosaurus Brachiosaurus was one of the tallest creatures ever. Its long neck reached leaves high in the trees. With legs like pillars and a gentle nature, it ruled the treetops peacefully among clouds of green. Velociraptor Velociraptor was small, quick, and clever. It hunted in packs and used curved claws to catch prey. It was about the size of a turkey, and it was smart enough to plan and share food with its group. Pteranodon Pteranodon ruled the sky with wings wider than a car and a long pointed beak. It glided above oceans catching fish in the wind. Spinosaurus Spinosaurus was one of the biggest meat eaters ever found. Its back held a tall colorful sail and it loved to swim in rivers. With a crocodile-shaped snout, it snapped up fish and splashed through warm swamps. Ankylosaurus Ankylosaurus looked like a walking tank. Its body was covered in armor plates, and its heavy tail ended in a club. Gentle yet strong, it used its tail to protect itself from any attacker. Parasaurolophus Parasaurolophus had a long curved crest on its head that worked like a musical trumpet. It made deep calls to speak to its herd across the plains. Its voice echoed through the prehistoric air. Iguanodon Iguanodon was one of the first dinosaurs humans discovered. It had thumb spikes to defend itself and strong legs to travel far. Calm herds of iguanodons wandered across rivers and meadows searching for plants. Mosasaurus Mosasaurus ruled the ancient seas. Long and powerful with flippers and a tail like a shark, it hunted fish and turtles in deep blue water. It was the ocean's fearless giant. Pachycephalosaurus Pachycephalosaurus had a thick round skull used for bumping heads. Its dome could be 20 centimeters thick. Scientists think they used head budding for play or to show strength to other members of the group. Archaeopteryx Archaeopteryx was part dinosaur, part bird. It had feathers and wings but still kept claws and teeth. Gliding through forests, it marked the first step toward the birds we see today. Allosaurus Allosaurus was the fierce hunter of the Jurassic. It had curved teeth and long claws that helped it tear food apart. With forward-facing eyes, it could judge distance perfectly, making it a skilled predator. Diplodocus Diplodocus was a gentle plant eater with a neck longer than a bus and a tail that could crack like a whip. Moving slowly in great herds, it ate from the tallest trees and drank from cool rivers. Gallimimus Gallimimus was fast like an ostrich. It had long legs, a light body, and a small head with no teeth. 
It raced across open plains in groups, outrunning danger and nibbling plants and insects along the way. Carnotaurus. Carnotaurus had two horns above its eyes and short stubby arms. It was fast and it chased smaller dinosaurs through forests. Its quick turns and muscular tail made it one of the fastest hunters of its time. Therizinosaurus. Therizinosaurus was strange but gentle. It stood tall with giant claws, almost one meter long, perfect for pulling down branches. It was covered in feathers, and it looked fierce, but spent its days eating plants. Deinonychus Deinonychus was a smart pack hunter. Each foot carried a curved claw, used to strike prey. Working together, a group could bring down animals much larger than themselves, showing early teamwork in nature. Mayasaura Mayasaura means good mother lizard. She cared for her babies in nests, bringing food and protecting them until they grew strong. Fossils of entire families show how loving and social these dinosaurs were. Chilophysis. Chilophysis was one of the earliest dinosaurs. It was thin, fast, and light, perfect for chasing insects and small reptiles. Living near rivers, it hunted in groups and filled the Triassic lands with life. Eutaraptor. Eutaraptor was the largest raptor ever found. It had feathers, long claws, and powerful legs for leaping. Hunting in packs, it was swift, strong, and highly intelligent. Pachyrhinosaurus Pachyrhinosaurus was a cousin of Triceratops, but with a thick bumpy plate on its nose instead of horns. It lived in herds and used its head and frill to defend its young from predators. Dimetrodon. Dimetrodon lived before true dinosaurs appeared. It had a tall sail on its back that absorbed the sun's warmth. Though reptile-like, it was an early step toward the animals that would later rule the earth. Oviraptor. Oviraptor was once thought to steal eggs, but fossils showed it guarded its own nest. With a beak like a parrot and feathers covering its body, it cared carefully for its eggs beneath the warm sun. Ankylodocus Ankylodocus was a mix of strength and grace. With the long neck of Diplodocus and the armored back of Ankylosaurus, it could reach high leaves and still protect itself from attack. It was a new discovery that amazed scientists. Truden Truden was small, but smart. Its large eyes saw clearly in the dark, and its brain was big for its size. Quick and curious, Truden may have hunted at night and learned faster than most other dinosaurs. Quetzalcoatlus Quetzalcoatlus was the largest flying creature to ever live. With wings longer than a bus and a long pointed beak, it soared high over lakes and plains searching for food. It was the king of the skies. How did dinosaurs disappear? Some say that a massive asteroid struck the Earth, sending fire and dust into the air, the sunlight faded, plants died, and with them the great dinosaurs. It was the end of their reign. Dinosaurs may be gone, but their story continues. Scientists still dig for fossils, and children still dream of the giants of the past. Their world lives on in our curiosity and imagination forever. The End